welcome back to the channel where we will show you how to make more money, spend less money, and increase your quality of life. This is Cheapskate Channel. And what we will do today, we will, it comes under the category of making more money. And I'm going to talk to you about, uh, basically I call it the poor man's way to investing. And this is one facet which almost anyone can get involved in if you have even just a little bit of money. I'm quite sure that you've heard of people flipping domains and flipping websites and things of that nature. Well, actually, it could be very profitable. And it costs literally nothing to get into. And the major thing you really need is not a lot of technical knowledge, except for how to get around on your computer. But it's just a big imagination on how to do it. That's the major thing. And I've been involved in the process now for a little bit. And I have to admit, if I can do it, I think anyone can do it. And you're quite sure you've come, you've probably heard of websites with catchy names to it. And everybody's talking about they wanted a dot com at one time and have dot com, dot biz, dot org, things of that nature. And people are making money by coming up with these names, purchasing the rights to these names, which is by reserving or registering a domain name, putting it up for sale, and making money from it. And there are a lot of marketplaces out there that will register your domain name for you and will place it up for auction for you. And, of course, they get their little commission, which range from 10% all the way up. And you can even market these things on eBay and the online auctions, so sell them anywhere you want since... Once you've registered a domain, you're the registered owner, and that's your property, and you can sell it. I'll give you an example. I registered about five domains today, and I paid five dollars and eighty-eight cents for each of the domains. No, I take that back. Five dollars and eighty-eight cents for two of the domains, and one for eight dollars and eighty-eight cents. And I fully intend on making a profit off of each one of them, as these are .com sites. And they're not very long dot com sites. They're about four or five letters then dot com on it, but they are meaningful letters. And I see a lot of sites with like XEB, whatever it is out there, and don't have any logical meaning to it, and people are attempting to sell it. I found that there is more success by using logical names, something that people can identify with a certain condition in life, so that it can be sold. You can do this too, and you can make money in it. Remember, I'm cheap, but I believe in having the nice things in life, and I always search for ways to increase my income so that I can have a decent quality of living and meet my financial needs and survive, like I'm quite sure all of us are trying to survive. But this is one possibility you can do with websites, or it's called domain flipping. You can also do what's called website flipping, whereas you register a domain and then set up a little website and draw traffic to it. You can sell those for a little bit more. It takes a lot more work to get something like that set up, but you can do it. Now, another thing that's kind of in the middle of uh, buying a domain and putting it up for sale and getting a domain, setting up a website and selling it, and there's something in the middle called parking a domain, which is coming up with a website name and then parking it and letting the company that lets you park it there put ads on it and then they pay you a commission for click click throws through the ad now this is another very lucrative thing too where you don't necessarily have to sell the domain you can actually build your portfolio of them and they can make you bank all this time and so either one of those or what your pocketbook and your patience will allow you to do will be the best thing to do to be able to indulge in the true cheapskate lifestyle, which is having more money coming in than you have going out and keeping the money that you make and not giving it to the people who want to suck you dry. And we all know what that is. Okay. And let's uh, see, I've talked about that. Now, the thing, let me give you some idea about places where you need to go to register your domains and park your domains and also sell your domains. I'm quite sure, you know, you can do a Google search out there to find uh, the best domain 
parking places or the best domain selling places, let me give you a tip on domain registration. You of course want to go to the site which lets you do the registration for cheaper. And there are lots of sites out there that give first time customer discounts and there's some out there that give coupons also for X number of dollars off to register a domain with them and some of them just have sales on them. I use CheapDomains.com, I've used Sidu, and I also use a site called NameCheap.com. Oh, backtracking a little bit, Sidu is spelled S-E-D-O.com. And once again, I use NameCheap, N-A-M-E-C-H-E-A-P.com, of course, use the cheap. And uh, these seem to have served really well. Of course, they have some of the old favorites out there called After Nick. And, uh, you know, you just have to search around for them and find. But Google is your best friend. I'm regretting that the Google AdSense people used to have a similar service, but they've discontinued it. Uh, but they have lots of other sites out there where you can get into the marketplace for them. And remember, as I said before, you could come up with a registered domain and put it up for auction on eBay and make nice money. You won't make as much on eBay. But come up with a specialized domain name with as few letters. Don't come up with something like, this is my domain name that I just thought up dot com. Nobody wants to type that in. Would you want to type that in on a web browser? No. Come up with something like, I love whatever. Or something that gives four or five letters, then the dot com or dot org in that nature. This is something quick, something easily memorable, something people wouldn't mind typing in and more importantly something that will sell well I'm not gonna rank on about this I'm gonna try to keep this as brief as possible but this is one way that you can be the poor man's or poor ladies uh, way to invest in something and get paid royally for it because if you pay five dollars or ten dollars to reserve a domain name and you sell it for five hundred eight hundred a thousand heck I got couple of domains on there right now I have listed for twenty five hundred dollars a piece and I only paid five or eight dollars to reserve the domain name that's what I call a profit and this is something that you can have a profit into and I thought I'd share this information for you so that you can have this break too because information I don't believe in charging for information information is free but it's up to you to get off your butt and do something about it once somebody tells you because I'm not going to take you by the hand but it's up to you to be responsible for your own financial future I'm what do they call it a voice crying in the wilderness trying to get you to do something try to get you to 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 get out of this broke condition or the paying condition and get into the condition where people are paying you anyway hopefully if this information has been of some use to you, I'm going to quit preaching now. And like I said, if this information has been of use to you, please like and share this video. And also please post the link to this video, which is located at the top of your web browser on your Facebook, Instagram, Twitter site. And say, hey, this is a way you can make money on the net. Check this guy out. I'd gratefully appreciate it. And stay tuned. For many other talks that I'll be giving on this channel about how to make money, how to save money, and how to have a good quality of life by not paying everybody all your money out all the time. Thanks a lot, and we'll catch you next time.